Good morning, folks. We've got a look at the sun. Three excellent articles with some context around the last one. We'll be hitting magnetic crochet flare effects, pre-earthquake signals, and the major climate cycles. We'll be going live later tonight as well, but we're starting with the last 24 hours on our star. Another calm day. The far side contains most of the activity right now, but the sunspot should return this coming week. Solar wind and geomagnetic conditions are nominal too. We've got that big filament facing Earth right now. We're watching that for eruptive activity. First up in the articles is this. A lot of articles on the magnetic crochet effects of solar flares lately. Most people don't know that the flare itself can have significant magnetic effects on the Earth even before the plasma of the coronal mass ejection arrives. This is why technological disruptions can occur at the onset of the flare. Good paper here. Up next, we're back to more pre-earthquake signals, but this time it's not atmospheric electricity, it's the magnetic field of Earth. Great confirmation of the localized magnetic changes before earthquakes, and this is one of the first European studies on the subject. Top story today gets a nod for the conclusion, but a head shake for the hypothesized rationale. It is confirmed that the 1500-year dansgaard oschker warming events sync up at the 6,000-year mark with Heinrich events the major millennial oscillations in Earth conditions. But where they guess about the internal dynamics being responsible, we find a lack of memory for previously published work on the solar Heinrich bond cycle here from 2021. Bond events are the useless name given to dansgaard oschker events in the Holocene, and we not only already know that it's the sun driving them, but the major superflare cycles of the sun are millennial, 3,000 and 6,000 years. Little more on that in a future video. Folks, tonight around 5 p.m. my time, USA Mountain Time, which is 7 p.m. Eastern, we'll be going live to discuss the acceleration of the magnetic pole shift confirmed this week. Notification will go out on X, Twitter, about 15 to 20 minutes beforehand. You should be following me there, by the way. And lastly, if you will be in Colorado Springs next week, we'd love to see you at our lunch event on Tuesday the 16th. Lunch is included. Link is below. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now, it's 5.15 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.